SAS stands for Cells Act uh, Alive System. It allows organic tissue to be safely and non-destructively frozen. In this game, SAS is used to put people in cold sleep. It supercools a subject with a magnetic field and causes them to freeze almost instantly, preventing crystallization. In real life, the problem comes when you try to thaw something out, which also must be done instantly. In this game, however, the technology, uh, technological magic of the treatment pod makes returning from cold sleep possible. The game literally just fucking stated that it that the technology is magic. <laughs> like, I can't Ooh. even take you seriously when you can't take your own. By the, by the way, the past two nonary games. November eighteenth, sixteen children were reported missing. November eighteenth. <laughs> oh, November twenty eighteen. I'm sorry. Also, wow, that happened in twenty eighteen. Oof, coming up soon. Uh, 16 children were reported missing. In actuality, 18 children were taken, but two were never reported. The person in charge was someone we will refer to as H. Why? The purpose. We of this know who it was. Yeah, what the fuck? If <laughs> you're like, if you're like, reality and immersion breaking documents, why don't you just say the truth that we already know from the previous game? The purpose of this of uh, the game was to conduct experiments on more uh, morphic resonance with the children as test subjects. I won't go into the specifics here. You could play nine 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 if you want to. But the short version is that uh, <laughs> that this was I the first. I thought it said that because that's totally what they say sometimes. <laughs> but the short version is that this was the first known game. November first, twenty twenty seven. A total of nine people participated in the session. They were uh, they were abducted just as the children had been. But this time H was not in charge of the game. Clover was a participant in both games, and now she finds herself playing the nonary game yet again. Dun dun dun. So you just described the plot to us? Yeah, I guess so. <coughs> I actually read what it says. Esper resonance. <coughs> in the context of this game, espers are people with the ability to access the morphogenic genetic field. An esper can increase the strength of their signal by being in close proximity to other espers, assuming they are the strongest. The strongest signal will absorb any weak ones nearby and use them to amplify its own strength, sort of like waves. The biggest wave adds the the amplitude of smaller waves to its own and covers them up. Uh, only if you have additive interference and not destructive interference, because I, I mean, sorry, only if you have constructive interference and not destructive interference, because if you have destructive interference, then each of the waves would actually be reducing the size of the other wave, because that's how waves work, you fuck. I'm too dead to understand. Do you know how that works, though? Did you study waves? What, Esper waves? No, waves. Waves, what do you mean, like waves? Like, like radio like waves. Oh, like, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, constructive and destructive yeah. interference and depends on how they sync up with each other. I was like, what? I know, Keith, I didn't go to the beach and study fucking waves. Like, yeah. <laughs> Wow, that one came very destructively. Not an, not an veterans. The following nine people were, were participants in the nonary game that Clover claims to have been part of. Cl claims to have been, you fucking asshole, you, you just fuck, had a clipping. We were there. But you just had a clipping in the paper that There's said the exact date. There's a picture of the car she's in. <laughs> she's yeah. in that car. Yeah. Ace, middle-aged man. Snake, Clover's older brother. Real name, Light. I'm sorry, you cannot summarize Ace as just being a middle-aged man and not the leader of the entire organization that caused the first two. What the fuck is that summary? These summaries are worse. Gets worse. Three, Santa. Arrogant, uncooperative, young man. Clover, still Clover, just younger, and with a jacket. What Five. The fuck? Wait, so... Junpei's the hero. That's her That's his entire characteristic. Hero of nine hours, nine persons, nine What the fuck? He's just... What the fuck? Deal Junpei me. was the hero of the game. That is the only defining characteristic. June, Junpei's childhood friend. Real name, Akane Kura, uh, Kurashiki. That's what she was. Definitely not, like, more importantly, like, a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hate Time traveling this. ghost best friend. Uh, seven, amnesiac detective. Lotus, attractive programmer, has two daughters. Uh, why, what? Okay. Uh, Kubota, skittish man, gets blown up. <laughs> wow. Poor fucking nine, Get man. fucked, Kubota. <laughs> right? Fucking Kubota gets, like, the worst summary Junpei, ever. Junpei, hero, Kubota, blown up. <laughs> like, like, Kubota has the worst summary because it's just, like, cowardly fuck gets destroyed. The only dead, like, the only person who dies. Yeah. <laughs> he died to be an example of everyone so that everyone could then not die canonically. Like, like Slipknot. That's Slipknot, the man who can climb everything. He's definitely not less important than the other characters. Don't read into that. Oh shit, he's dead. <laughs> and then... Ah. Uh, Neo Stigmin. What the fuck is it? Oh, it's a stupid gun. Yeah. A type of... Uh, carbamate? A type of carbamate compound, right. which acts as a reversible ass... 
Yeah, Astilclo... Asticolansterase. Astyl... Colinsterase, I think. Astyl Colinsterase. That's a hell of a fucking word. In uh, incubator. Exciting right, the parasympathetic nerve. <laughs> that allows them to counteract the effects of the muscle relaxant turbocurine. It can be delivered with an injection gun like the one you see here. So we specifically have a gun that undoes turbocurine. <laughs> Alright. Uh, okay. The only thing you have going for you is that when you read giant chemical names like that, it's a little bit like trying to re read the English versions of Japanese words. Where oh, every individual yeah. syllable has a specific pronunciation that's usually always the same. I just want to see what that word looks like in Japanese. <laughs> it's just a line. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a picture of the gun. Like they just draw the picture <laughs> they just of the draw gun, the gun. Kanji. <laughs> they, they, they just go back to the OG roots of kanji and just from then on every new word is just a drawing of what it's of. <laughs> That's what kanji is. I know, but they, but they go full on back. <laughs> like it's just like, it's just a gun. <laughs> like computer is just a computer? <laughs> like... They just draw a computer with a keyboard and everything, but it's like a specifically the old version where it was like a block. Yeah. Like a big beige one. You have to you have to use color in your language <laughs> to fully illustrate drawings of everything you talk about. Basically, emoji. Yeah. J Japanese just becomes emoji. Yeah. I am the emoji now. Next password. Ding! I hate that it does that. It has to in order for us to type the other password in, so it can somehow well, no, but it magically have to... rearrange the compartment inside. Well, I'm saying it doesn't have to kick you out. You know. Yeah. Like it can close and then bring you back to the input screen. Sun. <clears throat> sun star, sun. Sun star, sun. Sun. Star. Sun. What the, what the, what the, I hope this gives us the way out. <gasps> it's the gun. Phew. <laughs> hey, look, it's the gun that we just read about. Yeah. How interesting. I wonder what it does. <clears throat> it's open. Good job. That's twice you opened it. Wait, you're canonically aware that I opened it twice? Yeah, what the fuck? Are those documents real or not? Make up your mind. And she's not questioning the fact that it's opened multiple times? Like, where is the stuff inside of it coming from? When it changes the stuff inside? How does that work? Uh, I'm so confused. I thought it wasn't canonical, but it is? <laughs> Whoa, that thing looks dangerous. You mean this gun thing? Yeah. I wouldn't worry about it. I read about this in a golden file. I think this is an injection gun. Did we not use one already? We did. That's how we put him to sleep. Yeah, that was this timeline, right? Yeah. Why are they like, what's that? Keith, they don't remember stuff after they've seen it. I don't understand. Not, uh, not a weapon. Or oh, it's a helpful tool, not a weapon. Are you sure? We literally just watched it be used. I think that kind of uh, depends on what's in that vial there. The label says Neostigmine. Huh? If only we had some way of knowing what that means. What did you say? Neostigmine? W why does that mean something? L let me see it. What, are you a fucking medical professor Neostigmine. Now? Neostigmine. I feel like I've heard that somewhere before. Flashback to Ace. I counteracted the third of the but the segment. No good. I can't remember. Damn! I don't think it's bad, though. Do you have any proof? Nope, definitely not that gold document from a second ago. Of course not. Which I just confirmed that I saw you open. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Um, could you let me hang on to this? Are you sure it's not dangerous? The gold files just actively don't make any sense. What would you do if it was? All right. It's like, what are you gonna do about it? <laughs> I uh, trust you. That's a mistake. You don't seem like a bad person. She fucked over that old man because he looked gross. <laughs> that was her logic. Yeah, basically. that was like her logic. Hee <laughs> 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 Uh, take it from her. Take it from her right now. <laughs> that dumb voice. Hey. All like, all I could think of was like, when I'm the princess, I'm gonna make you die for me in a horrible explosion. <laughs> God. <laughs> Thanks. 
Then how about I let you take me on a date sometime? If we get out of here in one piece! Oh my god, that's why she's insufferable and always in cute poses, because she's supposed to be the love interest of this game? No, she's not the love interest. Even though she's Fee still- is. isn't she still too young? No, Fee is the love interest. That seems like what they're going for anyway, No, though. they're just making her a slut! No, it's a harem anime, everyone loves the guy for some reason, even though he has no defining characteristics. I mean, look, Sigma is pretty jacked. He is jacked as shit, that's his only shit. characteristic. And, you know, <laughs> and it, he and also we, and is- And we only have like two hints that that's true, because he's never on camera. And he almost has a PhD. Almost. He's a jacked- dude with an almost PhD. That's a girl's wet dream right He's there. He's 0.9 Brian Wex. <laughs> also, Clover is still underage. But beside that point... Japan! Japan! Yeah! Cool. Moving on! We've still got a bunch of stuff in here. Yeah? But it's all flat stuff. Sh shut your face. What, what does that even fucking mean? Also, keys aren't flat. <laughs> also, what? Uh, y yes it is. The first we've got, uh... Very good, Clover. It is flat. <laughs> a map. Floor B. The map I found in the infirmary said floor A. I guess that means floor A is the top floor? I mean, we took the elevator down to get here, right? Yeah, that sounds right. Up next, some gray cards. Key cards. They've got moons on them, too. These must be the moon keys the announcer was talking about. There are two of them, just like with the sun keys. One for you and me. And the other one's for Quark. But he's, uh... In... Taking a nap. <laughs> he's a pod person. He's a little radical right now. Well, she stopped smiling for five seconds for that one. Well, there's no much point in giving it to him. Jesus. I'll hang on to it for now. Okay. What's next? A piece of paper with something written on it. Here are some more AB game rules for you. Not voting is not an option. Option. I'm not saying you that. You have to say it. I'm not saying you that. You have to say it. Well, then you better kill me. <laughs> not voting is not a option. If both parties refuse to vote, then everybody gets penalized. In other words, one person out of every color group of three has to vote. In other words, all three of us can't not vote. One of us has to. So either you or me, you mean. Oh well. I'm sure that won't come up any time later. Like immediately after this. There's no reason not to pick Ally in the, uh, Ally in the next round anyway. Of course, first we've got to get out of this room. And that'll be easy. Just look at the last thing in the safe. I can't, it's not flat. <laughs> Key to the exit. <laughs> I'm still the tablet. We'll take it with us. Let's go! We've done it. We've escaped. We've achieved maximum escape. Man, I can only imagine that the next coming oh, up dialogue... Oh, is that where we came in from? The next coming up dialogue is going to be old man getting super butt hurt at us because we didn't bring his kid back with us. <laughs> Are we just going to leave him in the pod yeah. even though he's not frozen? Yeah. He's, just not, he's not even frozen. He's just sitting there. We didn't accomplish anything by leaving him there. Besides locked that, him in. So I guess he is locked in. He can't hurt himself inside of a pod that's meant to heal you. I'm ready. Okay, let's do this. Three, two, one, turnkey. Always with the countdown. I like it. I like it. That's why you complained about it several times. It sets tension. Does it though? Maybe sometimes it won't work. Oh. Maybe sometimes oh, it'll no. forget how to count to one. The gate has been opened. Forty-five minutes remain until Ambidex game polling closes. No. Oh, they're already what the voting. Hell? They're already voting. Yeah, what the fuck? They went on without us, like dicks. How does that even Somebody work? Somebody else must have opened one of the AB rooms. Why would they do that? <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> Whatever, we should be heading back anyway. They're trying to race us. I headed for the door. Wait. Clover's voice stopped me. What is it? I turned to see her pointing toward the wall. With the treatment pods. The screen, it changed. What? 
The screen on the pod's monitor thingy. How did you see that from there? Also, turn this laser. Yeah. You're gonna hurt someone's eyes. Oh, yeah. It says recent operational records. I stepped closer and began to read. What it said was interesting. Currently treating one subject. That one subject had to mean Quark. This was the pod we put him into, after all. I read on. Uh, 748, one subject released. 806, one subject successfully restored. 816, cold sleep mode is engaged. Beginning restoration of one subject. All prior records have been erased. Authorization admin. I checked the other pods. They were all the same. Did it just say all prior as an earlier, uh... The records were erased, but it was listed chronologically after stuff? Yes. So the, the, we just finished reading prior records. Yes. But it says prior records were erased. Shouldn't it have said that first? Yes. It should have chronologically said all prior records are erased, then start showing the new records that were after they were erased. Yeah. All right. 748, one subject released. 806, one subject successfully restored. Okay, it's the same fucking thing, just skip it. What does it mean? It's just going through and telling us that someone it was released. Doesn't just sound backwards, though? I feel like it should be cold sleep and disengaged, subject restored, subject released. How are they released first? What does that mean? Oh, wait, it's going the opposite direction. Like, yeah. all of that feels backwards, right? But the times are wrong? Oh! Maybe that's negative hours. As in, like, seven hours and 48 minutes ago? Oh. So the top one's the newest one, and that's why it weirdly says all prior things are erased last, because that's the oh, oldest entry. I see, I see. That's not the time, it's how many hours ago it was. Okay. So for so I so I am right about the order then. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, beginning restoration. Okay, yeah. It's just a it's just a weird negative notation thing. Whoa, what is all this? saying that about eight hours ago somebody in this pod woke up from cold sleep well three people actually one for each pod they all say the same thing maybe they're all in the same pod that's before we all woke up huh pod people pod people i mean it hasn't been eight hours yet tastes like pod talk like people whoa yeah. God. so the three pod people could be three of us they are, it just said Poppy. They could have been captured earlier. Don't know how much earlier. Then they were thought out eight hours ago and carried into the AB rooms. Oh my god, we're gonna find out that Quark was actually from the 90s. <laughs> yeah, that seems reasonable. That'd make no I sense. I really don't think there'd be anyone else in here besides the nine of us. So, well, old lady we found that was... It's actually the ten of us, huh? Old lady we found dead. K. Did, but didn't we find the di yeah wait, that's what she's saying ten of us I'm like she like yeah we found the old lady at this timeline right yeah yeah if you count the old woman we found then it would be ten wouldn't it it's almost like there might be three other people judging by the evidence presented by there already being another person it's a weird thing for them to assume in this timeline that that three of us must be the pod people except those old people didn't have watches uh, didn't have watches so Maybe, they can just walk right out of the doors once they open it's probably why they're from the pod yeah but then not from the ab rooms but i'm saying like that means they could just walk out once the door opens they're not really a threat yeah i don't know what their role is so who are the three pod people don't ask me to know that all it says is subject a that's creepy b it doesn't tell us anything about who they might have been hmm it doesn't say when they were put into the cold sleep either and this bit where it says all prior records have been erased authorization admin that seems pretty suspicious to me does it I wonder why they wouldn't just write the time, though. What? Well, you said it yourself. The log says eight, says eight hours ago, not like 9.15 a.m. Those minus signs have to mean this far in the past. Who would ever write the time like that? Exactly. 
Weirdos. Yeah, that is weird. Maybe Zero Senior doesn't want us to know what the actual time is. It's 2050. Boom. Why not? Hell if I know. Hmm. Speaking of things I don't know. Why did this stuff suddenly show up? It seems like whatever it was that triggered this activated as soon as we opened the door to leave. Wouldn't that mean Zero Senior set it up to work that way? Yeah, but why? That's why I'm asking. What reason would he have to do that? Maybe he wanted us to see the records. Perhaps, but he deleted a bunch of the data. Why? Just to reveal that people were in these pods and then nothing else? And he's just a fucking trolling dick? Yeah, that, more or less. I mean, last game he literally made it so none of the, trick? the watch's numbers mattered. So, like, you know, I don't. The watch, yeah. The, the welcome to nine nine nine, where the numbers don't matter and the doors lie to you. <laughs> God damn it, that what game. A shitty fucking. Uh, it's a terrible like a, premise. It's yeah. It sounds like a terrible TV show. You know, like one of those uh, uh game shows. Welcome to nine nine nine. The watches are lies. The doors are lies. Everything's a lie. Except, Everything's lies. Except for the one thing. There's bombs inside of you. Technically, we didn't say that. That's a lie through omission. Ha ha. Even though the rules are lies, but kind of it only get the <laughs> fucking fucking. Didn't we find out that also the the uh, the whole plot twist about the numbers on the watches supposedly not mattering or so, or not being true was just for a pair of people being swapped that would have been able to get the door if they were their original numbers too anyway, so it was like a pointless switch or something? Yes. Isn't that what happened? Yes. I don't know. Yes. A trick! All of these records are fake! Zero Senior just set it up to mess with us! So you're saying this was just a joke? Well, I can't say for sure, but it seems possible, right? Hmm... No, it doesn't make sense. Well, let's ask somebody else. Maybe they can think of something. Yeah, you're right. If the AB gates have opened, we need to be heading back to the to the warehouse anyway. Yeah, and we need to tell everyone what happened with Quark. We double-checked that Quark was all right in his pod, then hurried out to the treatment center. Sadly, sadly, while I wasn't Why looking. is he in the quark when he's not freezing? And why is he in the pod if he's not being frozen? This is the only it's, job it does. Well, yeah, but it stabilizes them. Remember, it seduces his children. By freezing them, right? No. You can do that without freezing yes, them? Yes. The freezing only, per, like... It does that via magic, too? Well, no, it just... Well, no, that's just... It's like saline solution, basically. I thought they suggested that the only way... That the whole point of, uh... Of being able to save him was that you do it by freezing. Maybe. They I could, thought I thought it was saying. Keem I feel like they could not have possibly made that no, pod th more pointlessly confusing. I thought they said it, it can st it can keep him stabilized, but it but cannot I, cure his disease, and the yeah, only way to cure it is by freezing him until a cure is found. I, I thought that the whole point of them saying they could stabilize it was saying they stabilize it by freezing him, because then all the activity stops. I thought that was the whole premise. Otherwise, why even go into all that detail? Uh, well, why even give us three pages of documents in the gold file about the, the that fucking That no one thing? knows exists. Yeah. 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 Is this another warehouse? Is it, though? It looks just like the other one. You can't see that. We didn't take a break. Shut up. <laughs> hey, could you show me that map? Can we just use it to get I here? I thought so. This one is right under the floor A warehouse. Huh, so it is. Oh. Are those... Those doors are white. And there are three of them. Okay, let's take a closer look. The Isn't 40... the AB room open? Yeah, I was about to say, the 45 minute thing's already started. These are chromatic doors. Wow, like all the doors? <laughs> I swear. <laughs> like every door is? <sighs> Uh, yeah, they should be in a hurry right now. Tell us more, Clover. See? They've got a little box right next to them, just like the others. So these are the third round chromatic doors, huh? I guess we'll be coming back here pretty soon if the game doesn't say to be continued like last time. 
Really, one of my things is I just wish we didn't have to deal with them rediscovering everything like eight times per playthrough. Yeah. Like, wow, it's, there's some white doors in this floor. Can't wait to hear that every time. It's handy when you can skip until you remember that like, oh it's yeah. It's a new combination of characters every time, so every time there yeah. could be new dialogue. No, and so, every time there is new dialogue. Exactly. So it's, but, no, but that's the thing. It's not new dialogue. It's... New, new characters dialogue. saying the same dialogue yeah, sometimes. It's, it's it's not even your character. Yeah. It's the new character going like these the main, are chromatic the main, doors. The main thing is the meet up with people in these three locations turned out to be new this time. Which, yeah. So I guess they might have written like six versions of that. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Yeah. Right. Yeah. <laughs> well, we might not have to. What do you mean? We both have six BP right now. Oh. I get it. Yeah, she's talking about betraying the unconscious child so that we can escape right now, which will definitely work. I mean, I kind of want to do it just to see an ending. What, I, I, yeah, I want to see why it secretly doesn't work, presumably, unless it does. And it's just like this is a good ending, air quotes, because <laughs> not not the best ending, but you got away, so fuck it. <laughs> it's the Andrew ending. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's true. So we're a pair, right? For this room, and then immediately not before and after. Well, she did promise to go on a date with us. <laughs> yeah. And who's our opponent? You're not. You don't like Fee anyway, right? <laughs> Dead. I mean, Quark. <laughs> exactly. We are monsters. She's a monster. <laughs> she's way, she's worse than Fee. And Alice. She's, she's like, let's take advantage of the dead, the dying child. <laughs> She is literally worse than Akane, who who captured people and put them into a death game that they constantly failed except for one time. So that she, for her own gain. Just so she could survive. Yeah. She, she did that at everyone else's expense without asking them. But uh, Clover is still a monster. Yeah. I also kind of want to escape just to see what the world is like outside and see if it reveals like, oh, the world's fucked outside. Oh, this is a mistake. It's actually 2075. <laughs> Everyone's radical. Everyone's so <laughs> radical right now. They're kick flipping in hell. <laughs> <laughs> but he's in the pod right now, so. If no vote is recorded before the deadline has passed, any non-voting parties will automatically ally. Results will be displayed in the warehouse. I feel like Grandpa would kill us before we got to the door. That's what happened. Okay. I was like, why is the text going so slow? And it's because the voice doesn't match the text and there was more voice at the end. Oh. There was an extra entire sentence at the end. And that's why the dialogue was moving so slow in the text proceeding, because it's based on how long the, the, the voice is. That was weird. You aren't saying we should pick Betray, are you? Weren't you planning to? I thought that was why you were okay with option C when we were making the groups. No, 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 that's not. Let's do it. <laughs> I just, I just thought that with Quark's condition, I'd be able to choose ally and not worry about getting betrayed. Oh, come on. You don't need to lie to me. We're partners. <clears throat> That means we share the same destiny. So let's not hide anything from each other, okay? We're, we're partners for these 30 seconds. Okay, well, uh, then if we're not hiding anything from each other, how old are you? <laughs> Seriously, what the fuck? Yeah, what are, are you're like, like, I could go on a date with you and then you'll get arrested. <laughs> like, do I need to go on a date with you to buy you clothes? I don't get it. <laughs> I'm not hiding anything. Seriously, like, she's still a teenager, right? And he's getting his PhD, and she's like, let's go on a date! I'm like, what the fuck? Is that supposed to be appealing? That's really uncomfortable. I mean, unless he's, like, getting his... Serious? Unless he's getting his PhD at the age of, like, 21. Like a badass or something? Even that's, like... Sigma, the most intelligent, idiotic man on the planet. Even that's kind of a significant age gap. If she's, like, 17 or something? What? No, it's not. But she's probably, like... He's probably, 18, like... 18, 19, 20, he's, 21, he's probably, like, he's probably, like, 28. <laughs> He's probably like 11 years older than her. I, I would be upset if he's my age. <laughs> Why? For one. Because of all no. the muscle mass? Well, for one, because he's <laughs> he almost has a PhD. For two, he's incredibly fucking idiotic. Like, Yeah, there, there's several questions. You were really going to pick Ally? Whoa. Hold on a second there. So I guess the dialogue treats it like you're literally always going to pick Ally every single time, no matter what, until you contradict it. 
Yeah. Even after you picked Betrayed before, you'll still assume that he's always going to pick Ally, and that's just his personality. Is good natured? Yeah. Well, well, that just, well, that got us a to be continued last time, so obviously we're just going to betray the fuck out of people now and see what happens. We might not get another chance like this. Let's say we ally and get up to eight points. We don't know if we'll be able to get any points next round. For all we know, there might not even be a next round. There are three other people with six BP, right? Dio, K, and Five. What do you think is going to happen if one of them gets nine points this round? That's not going to happen. Why not? V and Luna are playing against Tenmuyoji. He's only got one BP left, though. I really don't think they'd pick Betray. If Tenmuyoji picked Ally, they'd kill him. The same goes for Dio. He's playing against Alice and Kay, and Alice BP. No! Don't even think about that! What, the inevitable outcome of your own reasoning? Yeah. <laughs> I agree. But her BP is the same as Tenmoyoji's, so unless Dio's willing to kill someone, he won't be able to get his BP to 9. Then Alice has to vote Betray. Yeah, that's, that's generally the best defense choice. But if Dio chooses Ally... Then... K would have 9 BP. Yeah. Jeez. Well, it's just like I said then. If K gets 9 BP, then there won't be a third AB game. Well, that's not necessarily the case. So it's over when someone gets 9 BP. No. As long as that person doesn't open the number 9 door, the game goes on! So you think that K will stay here? Even if he gets enough points to leave? I don't know, but it's possible. No, it's not! Okay. Fuck. <laughs> Literally impossible, evidently. Remember, you will die. Well, we can think about how we're going to vote later. For now, we need to get back to the others so we can vote. Yeah, what the fuck? We can think about how we're gonna vote later? That's literally the current task. Wait, did we teleport? Or or did we already... Did we travel and I missed it? Or no. forgot about it? No. Because those are not white doors, right? But those aren't the doors with locks on them, so yes. Those are the doors that everybody else comes through when they're coming through. Oh, okay, room. yeah. It's hard to get a sense of space when the game's teleporting. I thought we were looking at the chromatic doors. I'm like, why are they back to looking... Are we we technically did move in this warehouse. We moved around. Like, yeah, no, I just thought we were... I thought, I, thought the, I thought the game might have suddenly forgot what floor we were on. Oh, no. And put us back on the first one. It's not that incompetent. There's a couple of things I gotta do when we get back. Like, vote and vote. Okay, back to floor A then. Let's move. I turned and headed for the exit. After a few moments, I heard Clover's footsteps following behind me. Is she gonna knock us out yes, with, she the, is. with the needle? Yep. Oh. Or not. When we're in the room, she bloop, will. Bloop, 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 bloop. We don't have a knockout needle, though. We have the thing that uh, counteracts something, don't we? Doesn't it counteract the knockout? I don't think that's the same stuff. I think the needle we got was the one that's full of the thing that counteracts the the anesthetic. Oh. We could check our secrets. And it would tell us everything again. Boom. I thought it had like that really long Well, if we go by room count, I think we're a quarter of the way through the game so far. We've done like four out of 16, right? Yes. Yeah, it'll only take us like four months to beat this game. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Maybe it speeds up later? I don't know. Maybe we'll do double, du double duty weeks at some point. God, fuck this game. <laughs> it depends on your your schedule, mostly. Clover. Alright. Oh, thank goodness you're back. Yep. Are we the last ones? Yes. Quark. Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> we killed him! We ate him! Tamiyoji's expression was furious, and from the way he was stomping toward me, I felt like I only had a few seconds before I was on the ground with his hands around my neck. 
But also, who clo who opened the doors early? But also, why the fuck do you think an old man can take you in a fight? You're like jacked as shit. Yeah, no. He looks like a very small old man too. Yeah. I explained what had happened with Quark and the pods as quickly as I could. So are these pod things really safe? Probably. Probably? I mean, no, you know, they're definitely safe. We're in a death game. Everything's a probably. Jesus, Clover. He's fine. Well, are they safe or aren't they? <sighs> Look, I, I'm just worried, <laughs> right? No one heard that. <laughs> Can you take me to this treatment center, Clover? Oh my god, dude, we don't have time. Uh, don't worry. We've still got 20 minutes left. Jesus, we lost more than we half lost of it already? 20 minutes? Plenty of time to have a look <laughs> and come back. No, it isn't. It took us 20 minutes to get here. Yeah, we had a, a short conversation. It took us 25 minutes. <laughs> what is that face? Okay. Come on, then. How about... <laughs> How about Quick, you, while she's gone, vote. How about you go, Clover? <laughs> I'll stay here and vote. <laughs> yeah, I'll just vote while she's gone. As soon as she finished, she was off. Tomioji followed at her heels, and in the blink of an eye, they were gone. Out of the ma uh, ma uh, magenta door. <laughs> magenta. Magenta. Me 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 how did we get to do? <laughs> oh, she just left without us. Yeah. Oh, cool. So this, you know, splitting the party when we're after crucial decisions. I can't wait to find out who dies in this context. That's usually how it goes. All right, you guys got some explaining to do. I beg your pardon. You opened the AB gates before Clover and I got back, didn't you? I want to know why the hell you'd go and do something like that. Sigma, take a look. Another body! I'm As guessing. she spoke, Fee gestured toward the line of AB rooms. Oh yeah, one of them's open. There's gonna be a corpse in it. Only one was open. It's not like we opened them all up. I'm sorry, did you say gestured? Yeah, gestured. What, is it gestured? Yeah. No, it's gestured. It's definitely not gestured. Gestured is a stupid way to say it. <laughs> it's, it's actually what the word is. I don't care what they think, it's what gestured. The fuck? Not gestured. Are you insane? Gestured is stupid. <laughs> how did you? How did you just? How could you just be wrong for thirty years? <laughs> easy, because no one corrects me. <laughs> it's easy. Everyone does it all the time. Yeah. I'm correcting you right now, it's, and our audience will. I mean, I don't. I don't know. America's been wrong for two hundred years. It works. Just not. No. No. So you're saying only one person or one pair jumped the gun here? Yes. Well then, who was it? I opened it. You fucking asshole. It was- Of course it was you, Dio! Yeah, he's losing a lot of points lately. It's really been like a... <laughs> Our opinion of Dio has been like the act structure chart of like a... Like Shakespeare plays. <laughs> where it just peaks in the middle and goes straight back down. <laughs> Figured as much. Not really a big deal, okay? I mean, you came right back. Yes, Dio. Yes, it is a big deal. It'd be a pretty big deal if we hadn't solved the puzzle yet. <laughs> it is like, right? fuck you. Why? If you hadn't made it back by the deadline, you'd have just defaulted to Ally. No, not just. Are you telling me you didn't know? You d didn't find one of these one of these notes. What? We found this in the treatment center. There was no such thing in the pressure exchange chamber. I didn't see one in the pantry either. Huh. Well, whatever. I can't wait to find out what- because because not everyone got this, I can't wait to find out that this is one of those lie rules like last game. Where they lie to us because they're liars. Yeah. You should really probably read it though. Here are some more AB game rules for you. Yay, she's gonna say hoppy. Not voting is not a hoption. <laughs> if both parties refuse to vote, then every bunny gets penalized. In other words, penalized. one person out of every color group of three has to vote. Is it penalized? You get it now? If we hadn't gone back in time, Clover, Quark, and I could have died! Oh, gotten back in time. I misheard you as gone back in time, and I was sitting here staring at the sentence like, the fuck did he just say? 
<laughs> like, does he know? Because we did go back in time, but I was like, what the fuck? When did they learn that that was a mechanic? 